Hello, everyone, and welcome to another fun-filled month of StephenCraft. This month, uh, I am joining Chase. Hello. And uh, Chase is joining me here in the, s the updated uh, server games lobby. And uh, it's, it's, it's updated. There is some new stuff. Uh, for one, server games has been... Uh, it was out for a little while. It was down for a little while while uh, some yeah, remodeling was going on. <laughs> Yeah, we had it out, and uh, we went through and decided that we needed to change it up a little bit, bring in some more maps, give players the opportunity to submit maps if they want to play, um, and staff to build their own maps as well. So we've set up the new system to allow that to be possible. Okay, so today, if, if people are wondering right now what's going to happen, we are going to be playing uh, server games. We are going to be playing uh, survival games. And uh, we have got a new map, which uh, Chase informs me is an old map that I may be familiar with. And it's behind this red tape. This is as close as we could get to red tape. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, uh, I, don't have, I don't have scissors, so I'm just going to punch it Nintendo style with my hand and destroy this red tape. Survival games downloaded. Interesting. So we got 23 people that can join. And uh, we haven't actually let the server know that this is open yet, but in a minute we are going to tell them, and they are going to start flooding in, all yes, while the, s the, the staff is, is eagerly watching. Uh, let them in. Let's do this thing. Okay. Here come the people. All right, should I probably click this thing now? Yes, go ahead and click. Woo! All right, so now that I'm in here, uh, the, what would you call this area? This is the lobby where you wait on your fate to be decided. The way the system works is once you join the lobby, it will randomly choose from up to six maps for hmm. you to play on. The way we've got it set up right now is I've got the voting engaged so I can sway which way the map goes so we can play on this new one. But other than that, it will randomly choose a map for everyone to play. And then you'll be teleported there at the end of the countdown. Interesting. That's uh, That's really cool. So... You're basically pushing survival games uh, in a much, much larger way. Correct. And, and you also said that you're going to be allowing uh, users to submit maps themselves, which is really, really freaking cool. Yes. There'll be a post about it on the forums as far as the application process goes and what we're looking for. Then the players will be able to submit and go there and have fun. Cool. Cool. Very awesome. So, when this timer ends, we are going to be transported into whatever it is that... Correct. That, ...that wins. Also, to help sway the vote even further, there's a chest in your hotbar. Uh-huh. Place it on the ground. Okay. Now, hover over the maps and look for the one that says Vlog. Okay, and then just left-click. Pick it up. Oh. And now you've voted. So, the, uh, uh, the Eye of Ender says leave the lobby, so that'll take yes. me out. That's correct. Don't right click. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be careful not to. Uh, so that's this is awesome. This is really cool. This is like uh, a very very fancy survival games. So on the on your right hand side here, the walls are the maze, and then there's a parkour course here. People can use while they're waiting. And three, two, one. We're in the map. Okay, and. We have 30 seconds until time begins. Mm -hmm. So get a good look around, see what's going on. Okay, and uh, we, we, Chase and I decided that before we started that uh, Chase and I would be on a team because we'll probably last a bit longer. Uh, I you recommend... You are directly across from me, right? A, a you see me jumping? Teammate. Chase is mine. All right, so I let everyone know. Uh, I see you over there. I'm going to check... Uh, nothing in nothing in here. Uh, oh, oh, got some TNT. Uh, do to do to do, do. The TNT is very useful. Be careful. As soon as you place it, it will light. Oh, really? Immediately? It's a, yes, and it will fire in a few seconds. Okay, I didn't really get anything useful. I got a wooden axe. Um, let's get out of here. This uh, this would be a good good idea. So. When you said that this wouldn't wa was going to be a little familiar with me, I see why. I can look up and see that clock tower, and it's bringing back 
terrible memories. <laughs> um, this is one that we put... I think we put it on Steven Vlog, actually. And uh, it, was, it was a map that we did with... Uh, pretty much most of the same people that we play, uh, you know, Stephen and Friends with, uh, Jeremy, Alex, Josh Jepson, uh, all those people, and uh, I remember there were the people floating, floating around trying to kill me. I think it was Jeremy actually. So where are we gonna go to? Oh, you found a chest. <laughs> I got, I got two pieces of string, two apples, a potion of stealth. An get instant the, uh, ignition bomb and a wooden axe. Get the boots. The boots? That way you have some armor. Woo! Alright, got the boots. Man, having a teammate helps a lot. <laughs> it's just... Where should we go? Should we go down? Uh, I'm just gonna slowly make my way down here. Can we k kill the pig for food? Yes, yes you can. Okay, because I'm, I'm gonna do that. Because uh, I don't remember what the apple gives you, but I... I fairly certain it's not a lot, and there's a lot of pigs in this area, and uh, one of the problems I've always had in survival games was lack of food, so I'm going to, uh, I'm going to vote we take out the piggies. So people can submit their own maps, but you said you're also going to be working on um, adding additional maps uh, just, I guess, found online. Yes. So, so you're going to be looking at other, other places to resource some maps. Well, there are four maps total that we have right now. That's what okay. this lobby is dedicated to. Um, those of you that join and look, you'll see that there are three offshoots to the main lobby for survival games. Okay. Each one of them is a different lobby that has a different set of maps in it. The sets of maps are going to be downloaded, player submitted, and staff submitted. Okay. There could be a maximum of six to ten each. Okay. And currently, um, we have however many characters can play at uh, a single time, uh, 23. But as you said eventually there will be, it'll be capable of doing multiple matches at once. Yes. Which is, which is pretty cool. So you could essentially have up to whatever number that is, 80, 90-something people playing? Correct. That's, that is pretty cool. So survival games is really getting uh, some special treatment. Um, what about uh, some of the the other games that are on Steven Craft? Because since I know TNT Run is a big deal, and uh, I don't know if you have plans for other stuff in the future. Well, TNT Run um, is going to be have a few more maps added. Um, okay. We're also going to go through and um, revamp all of that as well. Basically, okay. what happens is we're going to do a rotational game system. Also, here's a helmet for you. Woo! I like helmets. Oh, it's there. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I'm waiting for it. <laughs> Where did it go? <laughs> <laughs> but there's going to be a rotational map system, or game system. What that means is different times of the month, they're going to have different games on. So survival games aren't always going to be able to be played. Okay. So what this what it'll allow us to do is use bigger survival game servers without having to purchase more server hardware. Okay. And uh you'll be rotating games out, but because of that you'll also be able to hold a lot more players at a time. Correct. Okay. So if people have a particular game, then they'll be looking forward to a a particular time of the month. And then they'll be able to jump on and and get their survival games on or their TNT run on, etc. Well, the way we have it planned right now is for like a few weeks out of like the month. It'll also, be what does this games. mean? <laughs> what is the red? Uh, I think they're just torches. Oh, okay. The torches aren't appearing on my screen. <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's just the red and it's scaring the crap out of me. Because I'm thinking back to... Um, I know everyone knows Hunger Games, but I'm thinking back to uh, Battle Royale and how there were zones, and uh, you can't walk into certain zones or you just die. And I, for a minute, I was like, "Oh God, am I am I allowed to go in here?" Uh, yeah, ba Battle Royale was the original Hunger Games, and it was um, it was scary. <laughs> People got blown up. Anything useful up in there? Mm, got a sword if you need one. Um, I got this axe. <laughs> um, like, with, well, with the permissions you have on this server, the axe may not be a good idea for you. Really? 
Yeah, it's world edit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so we can make mass changes, and you have the same permissions I do, so if you click wrong, you you may delete the map. Okay, um, yeah, let's not delete everything <laughs> we <We'll> see. <laughs> Although I guess that would make the game very interesting. Also, um, you can break leaves if you need to. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm going to focus on doing that. See if we can get up through this cave. The ma This map is really big, and we've actually just been kind of wandering around por one portion of it. We should, um... We should actually... Let's see, can I fall here and be safe? Yeah, a little. <laughs> a little safe. We should get to higher ground and see if we can locate uh, something out in the distance and, and go check it out. Because um, uh, I know that clock tower's got stuff on it. I'm just kind of wondering at this point if someone hasn't like already gone up there and grabbed the stuff. I'm also kind of curious if other people have been grabbing teammates like I recommended at the beginning. Also, how are we going to get by? Can we go up here? Actually, we can do this. Yeah. There's a there's a rare spawn in these maps. Okay. Um. They're they, basically since you can break and place leaves, they give you six leaves every now and then. Oh, okay. So if you do it right, you can make yourself a nice little hiding spot in a tree. Or if ah. you get caught down a hole, you can um nerd pull your way back out. Have we been down here? I don't think so. I think this is new. There's probably something down here. Why would the... Uh-huh. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> Someone has been here. See, now, what I would do is I would... I would just sit next to a chest and, like, take all the stuff out and replace it with crap, and then people <laughs> would come down and look for the chest, and then I'd be like, Ha-ha! And then I would jump out and kill them. It would just be a really lonely game because you would just be waiting the entire time. Uh, okay. Oh, there's a chest up there on that bridge, although it's it's got high visibility, so someone probably already grabbed it, but it might be worth checking out. And I should also probably not run so far ahead, because if I get in trouble, I'm going to be like, Teammate! Teammate! Actually, where did you go? Uh, one second. <laughs> you were back in... I'm going to head up to that bridge, though. Okay, I'm on my way. I found something we didn't fix, and I'm just taking care of it. <laughs> okay. There's a lot to to have to look over and double check and make sure everything is yes. running smoothly when it comes to this sort of thing, I'm sure. So, well, we have a server department just for this. Ah, okay. And so that's head, headed up by an admin and his staff. Okay, also this is empty. Um, oh, hey, what's up, people? Okay, I've made the friendly sign. Friendly sign. Okay. F <laughs> friendly? <laughs> Keep them distracted. Are you gonna kill them? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> no, he got me! <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know, <laughs> I didn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> did you kill one of them? Uh, I don't know. I d did I don't uh, okay. Well, um now uh me and Mike uh are friends. So, um I think there was another April was here and I, I think, think she, she booked it. <laughs> I think she fell to her death actually. Um I think you blew her up. I'm not sure. So, it's going to be me and Mike. Um <laughs> Sorry, Chase. <laughs> You've been replaced. Um, me and Mike are on a journey now. <laughs> I don't know where to, but... Uh, here, take that. Where'd you go? What do you have? What is this? Oh, wow! You've got a good sword. Okay, yeah, sure, man. Uh, here, let me give you a... <laughs> what the best? There's so many... How'd you get all this crap? He uh, probably found a nice little stash chest. Wow, okay. Um, let's... Let me uh, let me give you a peace offering um, by s giving you. Oh, April's alive. Oh, okay. Oh, this is awkward. Uh, all right. Uh, three musketeers. <laughs> We're all friends now. Okay, great. Seems good. It's getting dark now. Does anything happen to the map in particular? Like um. um I know uh, in the other survival games, 
once there were fewer players alive, it would start to indicate where other players were? Um, that does happen. Okay, the There's lightning. There's also um, a death match on some of these. Oh. So, um, like, if you get down to, like, two players or something, or...? That's correct. Also, I really need to come kill some of these mushrooms before this map resets. <laughs> <laughs> they weren't supposed to respawn, but they did. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> this seems more like a feature than a bug, I'm going to be honest. <laughs> you um, just want the food. Uh, it is, it is, it is time to eat. <laughs> also, maybe I shouldn't waste all of this, uh, all of this stuff here. But I'm definitely going to take advantage of this because I uh, this is part of the map and I found it, and now I have plenty of food, so things are good. Things are good for uh, me and my team. Let me know when you have a decent amount of food. I think we have plenty of food now. <laughs> good. <laughs> and they're gone. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, enemies. Enemies! <laughs> I've decided that we can only have three, so uh, Kamaker will have to die. Sorry. Poor Cammy. The <laughs> they're running fast. We have we have to keep the squad tiny. Although April's missing, so it could be the new April. Do 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 do. Oh man, they are running hardcore. I'm. They almost knocked the lit creeper into you. That was funny. Oh. <laughs> oh man, I am having some serious. Hold on, I have potion of wait. That's stealth. Don't I have potion also, of rabbit? Potion of rabbit. Did I mention that Cammy's fairly decent at survival games? Well, not if I not if I uh, not if I kill him. <laughs> 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 I had I had the potion of the rabbit, so I I I caught up. But I had to I had to eat some food because I was in trouble. Oh no, my potion of the rabbit's gone because <laughs> I drank one. it. That's how liquids work. <laughs> Crap, yes, Steven, that's how liquids work. Um, this is actually a little problematic because they they got away, and I hit them. Oh, oh we're slain. Cammy's down. Go team! <laughs> Woo! Go Packers! Alright. So now, um... I want <laughs> Only five can ladder. Only three can team. Alright. We did it. Go Watch us. out for that baby zombie that's coming up on you. Because oh, yeah, once he fast. hits land, he's fast. Get out of here. Hmm. Come on, buddy. You're gone. Man, there's a lot of equipment in there. Good lord. Uh, man, everyone was loaded. Me and you didn't have anything <laughs> compared to what everyone else had. We ran and ran in circles for about five minutes. Good lord. This is crazy. Everyone had so much stuff. I'm really... I'm impressed. Apparently no one had any pants on. Pants are a little overrated. Um... Gracious sakes. Alright, well, uh, we should probably... There's so much stuff just laying around, too. I'm gonna get rid of something. I've, I've got... Strange Drink, Potion of Stealth. Now that's what I call high-quality H2O. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. And I get this glass bottle. Have seen The Water I'm... Boy? Uh, it's been years. It's been many, <laughs> many, many years. I have seen it. It's been a long time. Bents and I have thrown so many references into this. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I wish I had pants, though. I do wish I had pants. All right. Um, let's see. Uh, go to high ground. Okay. If you're just noticing your chat, midnight has rolled around. Something special's happened. Oh no. What does that mean? I'm not saying you should go check your chests again, but maybe you should go check your chests again. My chest? Oh, like in the middle? All of them. Oh, they get reloaded! Yes, they do. That's amazing! Also, it helps a lot, because... Wait, also... The only thing that's, uh... That's... I, not concerning, but... 
really changes the dynamic of the game is the fact that everyone's going to be... If they survive long enough, they'll be, like, freaking super-powered. Mm-hmm. Wow, holy crap. So that that is uh, that is a big change to I can't uh, remember if this one has a deathmatch or not. If it does, one more death, and it will begin the countdown for deathmatch. Okay. Um, noted. Man. Uh, let's see. I really... Okay, the clock tower's up there, but maybe I want to head back to the middle, because the middle, if they... Oh, is that my teammate? <laughs> I'm, I'm just so filled with bloodlust. All right, so there's some stuff in here. Wow, more stuff than I really need. Like, <laughs> really no reason for me to even take this stuff. Um, I'm gonna put. What am I gonna put? I'm gonna put cobwebs in here. I guess cobwebs could be useful, right? Yes, they can. Someone's following you. Spin around real quick. Drop a couple down. Huh. Okay. Also, when you said that, I, <laughs> I thought you meant literally someone is behind me, so I stopped checking the chest. It was like, what? <laughs> it did not become immediately clear. There's a fishing rod, but I don't need to do any fishing. Uh, chain boots. God, I need pants. There's bowls, and... There's all sorts of great things here. I just, well, I don't... We give you bowls, because some of these maps have sections with mushrooms in them. Ah, And they yeah, are yeah. breakable. Huh. Melons. All right, we've we've pretty much opened everything, everything there is to open. Um, let's see. Uh, why don't we go? Staying in this area is a good way to probably to find people. But I'm gonna say, let's head. Well, also everything is refilled too. Mm -hmm. That's right. Holy crap. Okay. Um, get out of here. You're dead. Maybe. Yeah, you're dead. Well, I guess there's really... We can just continue to explore. Man, that really does change it up, because one of the, the biggest things about survival games is that the fact that when you get... Um, you know, you, you after just a few minutes into the games, you, you get to chess and they're just empty. And it becomes not really a quest to find loot, but a quest just to survive. You're usually running out of food. So this actually changes it a lot. Admittedly, we also slaughtered about 400 cows, um, so we're probably good on that on that front. Oh, let's see. I oh god. Ow, oh god. What happened? I died. April turned on you. Oh! <gasps> I can't believe that. <laughs> How? What? Uh, what? Wow. 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 Oh, and then Mike killed April, I think. Man. Wow. <laughs> That's amazing. That was some serious drama. Oh, wait, no, he, she, he didn't kill April. April's right there. So I'm invisible right now, right? You are. And like okay, I said, so the I'm just spectating. in your hand. If you hold it in your hand and right-click it. Okay. And if you hover over each name, there's a different um, name there. Okay, so if I just click April, it just warps me straight to April, but I remain... Um, invisible. Invisible. Wow. Man, April. Holy crap. I thought we were buddies. I think... Okay. Chase, I'm going to put the blame on uh, on you for this one. I'm pretty sure she's uh, she was pissed at me because you tried to kill her. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I, <laughs> I was not aware that this was they a play. They had diamond equipment. We needed tools. <laughs> I walked up to them and was like, friendly? And then you blew them up. <laughs> Mike was trusting, but April had a plan all along. She was like, oh, I know. I'm, this is this is going to turn around. So now there's only three people left. Wow. And, uh, and April and Mike are alive. And they are teamed up. Although, you know what? I don't know if Mike should be trusting April. I'm going to be honest. Seems uh, Seems like a bad decision. Also... What was that, April? You just tried to blow up Mike using a creeper. Man. Yeah, I don't... Death Deathmatch starts in 20 seconds. Wow. So does that just warp everyone to the center? It... Sh oh, Deathmatch starts in 8 seconds. Someone killed somebody. On this one, I think it is center, yeah. So I will need to... Oh, no, it just warped me there. Mm-hmm. Wow, great. And here they are. There's another map. Um, if you want to play another round, we can play that map. 
Um, Man. When you... Uh, death matches on a completely different map. Mike, April, oh, so Mike and April are still team. Oh, they can, oh, it's just them. Ah, well, April has got experience turning on people, so this should be <laughs> should be a really easy, easy conundrum for her. Actually, no, they're they are they're kind of standoffish. I feel like April is pretty loyal. It's just uh, once again, you <laughs> you blew us all up, and uh, I think that that rattled her her trust. Oh, with me. they're they're gonna go fisty cuffs on this one. Really? Yep. Oh no. Oh, she's gonna try to blow him up. She's got TNT. Here she goes. Oh man. How much did she have? Wow. I had a lot. It's That's why I was getting ready uh, to blow them up. They got all my TNT. <laughs> <laughs> There's TNT all over the place. It looks like Mike about blew himself up there. This is, uh, man. This is, oh, they're laying cob. Oh, did someone get stuck in it? No, no, no. Now, April, April pulled out a, a, a bit of TNT there, so she still has some. Looks like Mike still has some as well. Oh, oh, the cobwebs, the cob... Oh, she's breaking them, though. This There's a lot of strategy going on right now. Oh, it oh. happened. Mike won. Mike got it. That was amazing. That was, that was hands down the most exciting games... Uh, or the exciting round of survival games I've ever seen. That was incredible. Wow. Good job, Mike. Mike was on my team for a while. <laughs> he, yeah, was my yeah. he was mm -hmm. he was my teammate. Um, anyway. Now what we're waiting on is a map reset. Um, at the end of each game, the map regenerates itself. Um, okay. Very cool. And when is when is this available to play for the viewers watching? You cut the ribbon. It's ready now. Awesome. Very, very cool. And people will be able to go in and vote for the map and then play map with their friends. That is that That's is correct. really, really awesome. All right. Uh, that is actually going to be it for this video. Uh, this is a very long video. We've... Uh, but I think it was I think it was worth it. So hopefully the viewers don't mind an extra long video if we're showing the entirety of a survival games match because they're usually pretty exciting and this one was especially exciting. Uh, Chase, thank you so much for for joining me and certainly thank you for being uh, the guide to uh, you know the new survival games. I appreciate that. As always, my pleasure. And um, I guess all that's really left to say is uh, join Stevencraft. Jump on and play some uh, play some survival games. Also, be on the lookout for another video very, very soon. I'm going to be giving out some information about doing some holiday builds. It was just... It was not that long ago we did some Halloween spooky-themed builds. We're going to be doing some Halloween builds. So if you're interested... Or not Halloween build, holiday builds. So if you're interested in that, stay on the lookout here on Steven Plays. We're going to have a video coming out about that very, very shortly. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys soon for more StevenCraft.